we're damned. We were supposed to be working in a kitchen today, right? Yeah. But the reality of it is, the wood that was donated to us isn't quite dry yet. No, it's too wet. It's uh, still too humid and it's, uh, it's not going to make a good result if we start building with it. We have progressed the kitchen as much as we could so far. That means that we sanded all the bits that needed to be sanded and we can't progress the project further until the wood is dry, which hopefully should be next week. Yeah. Which means that right now we are outside, right? Mm -hmm. And we're going to be spending the entire day outside because we are going to start preparing for our garden. Yeah. We, I mean, we plan to have a pretty big garden in front of the house in a roundabout shape so that we can take our cars around it and connect it back to the road, right? Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, so today what we're going to be doing is dividing and conquering a bit, right? Yeah. You need to work on the cherry hill while well, I'm going to be preparing some flower boxes or gardening boxes where you can just bring all the composting material in the box so that it can kind of start doing its yeah. thing and whenever we're ready to plant we're gonna have some good stuff in there already yeah. and we have a place to store or put everything because now it's just spread everywhere yeah every time we clean out the chicken coop we don't really know where to put their manure but now in the future we're gonna have a place for that yeah anyway today then we are working in the garden and we're preparing for the future yeah so let's do let's it, do it. of the road right there right and basically what we plan to do is to have one continuous flower box if you want to or flower box that will be following the road and just where we've got the tools in the corner we hope to be planting a beautiful magnolia tree at some point It doesn't help that we've been like putting the chicken stuff right there. No. So, like, it's so slippery. Yeah. yeah. You're like borderline dangerous. The heavy rain has totally resurrected one of our springs. I mean, it's just pouring and pouring and pouring. There's one, there's two springs actually, so there's one there that you guys can see, and then there's another one right here. And then we have plans for that, right? Leave the the vines in the ground. Yeah. Are you agreeing or? Yeah, yeah, yeah.
what we do, we take away this thing, which is silver, brambles, which we don't want to have on the, on the hill. Putting it in the burn pile, not in the compost. who's been watching homesteading videos we know that the good base of a like a flower box or a planter's box is cardboard now thankfully we have a lot of it we have so much cardboard because we bought like toilets and then we bought the shower and then we bought a lot of the materials for the house actually came in cardboard boxes. Now of course what I want to do is remove the plastic. I mean, yeah, <laughs> it's everywhere and we certainly don't want any in our food. So, so yeah, so basically what I'm doing the next step is just layering some cardboard at the bottom of the planter's box before I rake some leaves and then just start adding stuff in here that will start to decompose and I will hopefully help us grow some really awesome vegetables. So let's see. <laughs>
call it, huh? Huh? Time to call it. No, I want to finish uh, filling up his bed. If you want to help me, that'd be good. Yeah, I'll something I've done here. Good stuff, yeah. Yeah, for helping me, I'll get any help I can. Yeah. Oh, this makes me so happy. Organic material for free being used on our land to work towards being self sufficient. I mean, I love this. I love this. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, wow. The fog has really set in. It's floating in even more. Yeah. See it rolling there. Totally. Make sure the camera pick is fixed, makes justice of the, the density of the fog. Not sure either, eh? But we've been hard at it for, for a whole day, I oh, think. Yeah. So I think it's pretty much to say that for this week, this is all the work that we can do. But anyway, I mean, next week, please send us lots of good vibes. <laughs> we really want to be working in the kitchen and continue the progress because the bathroom kitchen combo is getting old it's getting yeah, old we need to move out from there but we can't speed up the wood process or drying of the wood it takes time it takes so send us some good vibe anyway thank you very much for watching guys see you next week see ya. ciao ciao Bye. I don't think, yeah, the camera doesn't do it justice to the amount of fog there is. I mean, those who know our land will know that normally we see the upper field there, but we can't see it now, that's for sure.